Hello, Pan 44 here, and this is my Big Finish Day 7 video thing. I'm not sure what to call it. Apologies for not being able to get the preparation vlog up. Um, I did rec I did record it, I, ha I uploaded it to the computer, I edited it together, and then YouTube decided that it wasn't going to be able to do it. Well, it wasn't be able to do it, it decided that um, I'm not going to upload. It just wouldn't upload, so I couldn't upload it, and by the time... I had to upload it twice, and then the second time it was taking like five hours each time. And the second time I tried to upload it, it was like seven o'clock at night. I had to be up, I go to bed early so I could be up in time for big finish day seven because I had to get out at half four in the morning so we could leave at five. And I just thought I can't leave the other one. Need leave the computer on all day. Let's just not bother. So I didn't. I wasn't able to do that. Oh, well, I didn't, I, I didn't get everything I had in that video get signed either, so... Yeah. Yeah, uh, first I'm going to go through the stuff I bought there, and then I'll sort of go into what I got signed and who I met and what happened at the event. Uh, apologies, everything... I don't, uh, when I'm looking at the camera here, everything is... I'm using my phone, everything is sort of backwards, so I don't know if it's going backwards when you're watching it, so if it is, sorry about that, I'm not sure. I might try and fix that during the editing, but I'm not entirely sure how. So yeah, the first thing I bought, I, I made sure I got that, was the Six Doctor Last Adventure. Yeah, I made sure I definitely got that, that was something I really wanted to get. Uh, that was the main reason I got the £5 cheaper than it is on the website, is that because it's £40 on the website, £35 a big finish day, so that was good. Uh, another thing I got was the beginning. I was quite interested in getting that one because like, it's like the doc Doctor's first story off Galloway's first, uh, the Doctor and Susan's first adventure. That was good. That was five pound. I bought Laws of the Red Planet and Ice War Origin Story. A double, a dual case, double CD case. That was five pound. I made sure I got two of the dual case ones because they're better value for what they are. Uh, I also got the Mega, another dual case. Uh, they seemed a bit surprised at how cheap that was. And I didn't think I was like, yeah, that's what I chose that. Um, Another Lost Stories, oh, the beginning was a Companion Chronicle by the way, that was £5 as well. Um, the first one, Tyrannus and Tyrant Origin, sort of, uh, that that was £5 as well. Another Companion Chronicle, Burning Summerfield and Criminal Code, I really wanted this because I love Burning Summerfield's character, she is my second favourite companion, so that's a Companion Chronicle. Uh, this one I specifically, I wanted to get this one, The Mahogany Murders. Uh, I wanted that one because it's sort of an introduction to the Jago and Lightfoot series, which I want to get into. Uh, and then lastly, Torture of Conspiracy, which is signed by several people. I only wanted to really get David Lewen David Lewenin to sign it, but he just sort of handed it around a sort of table and they all signed it, so bonus. Yeah, so I bought those throughout the day. Um, the first thing I did when I got there is I went to I went straight because Louise Jameson was only signing for an hour and a half apparently. So I thought I've got to go straight to Louise Jameson and I got the King of Sontar signed by Louise Jameson. I I, I was really lucky because there was a cut off for the queue because she had to be in a panel at ten o'clock, and the cut off was literally right behind me. I was the last person to get an autograph. The, I, st I spent the entire queue time talking to the guy behind me. And he, I was like, oh, sorry, mate, I'm getting autograph. Uh, apparently, she's coming back later, but it's good to be able to get that first. The next thing I did is, uh, is at 10 o'clock, I went to get my um, picture with Colin Baker. Because I, because he is my, one of my favourite doctors. Hang on, where is it? I've got everything sort of stacked over here. Ooh, I'm going to be careful with this. Yeah, I've got a picture of me and Colin Baker. Can you see that? Yeah, you can see that. Yeah. <laughs> it was really funny watching him. Um, yeah, I can't remember what it's called. It just talked to everyone. It, 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 there were some really funny moments, like one where the guy wanted them to put the finger out, so that they're both doing it. And um, the cameraman was trying to get the hand in focus, and then Colin just just went... Uh, and the player actually managed to take a picture with Colin Baker doing that, so he had to retake the photo. And that was funny. I then went to the... Um, what was the first panel? I can't remember. I should, should have bought the schedule and put it there, so I knew what was actually happening. Yeah, the schedule, that was, I think the first one, the big finish panel, was just general big finish. We walked in just in time, because we had been waiting for Katie Mann to do the signings, but we decided, well, she's not there, I want to go to that panel, I'll go to that panel and get an autograph afterwards. So I went to the panel, we walked in just in time for the, um, uh, 
the Doom Correlation 1 trailer. I mean, we also got the trailer for The Prisoner, not too bothered about that, and uh, Unit Extinction. Uh, they announced the name of the second, on the other unit one. The second box it. I can't. What, closure last night? So, so that sort of ends something. I can't remember what it's called. Ah, that's going to annoy me. Then after that, we then went, I then went and got the um, autograph from Katie Manning. Which was that. Oh, I forgot something. Uh, when I was actually standing in the queue for the uh, Louis Jameson, I, I turned around and there was um, Pertry Smith 11 from, from the Pertry Smith 11. I bent from Pertry Smith 11 was there. And because uh, I knew that him and TJ Productions were going, so I, I want to meet, I wanted to meet them as well. So um, I went, I went. So uh, as he came back, I, sh I said, "You're perfect for the lane." He went, "Yeah." I shook his hand, I said, "Nice to meet you," and then he walked off. <laughs> like I don't think he really acknowledged much at that point. So yeah, I, so, so yeah. I then went to. Um, I think it was on. I think it was as we were going to get the uh, autograph from Katie Manning that I passed them in the entrance, and there was Pertram Eleven and TJ Productions. And what surprised me is that TJ Productions actually. I said, I said, actually recognised me, and um, I, I was like, I, I didn't say anything at the time, but I, I was really surprised that he actually recognised me, or knew who I was, but then I realised, like, I was probably the only person on YouTube that actually said he was coming, oh, sorry. so the wall behind me, because it got two different things, it was confusing me, the camera, because like, the wall was in one place there, and one place there, so that's confusing me, anyway, yeah, and uh, I took a photo of them. I offered them jelly babies because I took like three bags of jelly babies with me in, in paper bags. I did it totally. And I offered everyone I um I, I got I met and had pictures or signings with. I offered them jelly babies. Uh, Louise Jameson was quite was quite happy. She was um she, she was really nice. Uh, and they offered her jelly babies. She was quite surprised. She said she needed she needed a little bit. She, she said to take one and save it for later. So yeah. um yeah. And then getting the order of Katie Manning, I was in the queue. There was a bit of a queue. Uh, Post Smith 11 was a few people behind me as well, so I noticed that. Uh, Colin Baker was in the room, Katie Manning was in the room. Oh! Sorry, I keep. I, I keep going to do things and I keep getting it the wrong order. Yeah, as I think before that, um, because in the area uh, you weren't allowed to take photographs. So uh, so my mum was taking a picture of me next to and a Colin Baker suit that was sort of on a stand thing. And Katie Manning went look at that and went went to walk through it and then realised that someone was taking a picture and she was like yeah. and then she photobombed me. I got photobombed by Katie Manning. That was amazing. She is so lively. She I I was surprised how much energy she has. She's so bubbly and energetic. She's she's always I didn't see her unhappy at all. She was always happy. So yeah. And then, well, well, I then went and get the autograph, but as I was in the queue, Colin Baker was leaving because to do more photo shoots, and I, I, I tried to offer, I offered him a jelly baby, and he said, "No, I don't like them." I, I was surprised by that. I was like, "Really?" Apparently, he said they, they taste, they taste like flavored tires. I was like, "Okay," <laughs> I didn't see about that going. Yeah. Then, uh, although the person that was sat next to Katie Manning, sort of do, all doing the tickets, was getting quite annoyed because um, he kept sort of taking too long with each person. <laughs> and uh, we didn't. I didn't mind at all. It's like that, that's who she is. She wants to do that. She can do that. Yeah, I got the uh, defector sign only because this was the only one I actually have of Katie Manning. Well, I got to the mega, but I didn't have that at the time, so I couldn't get that signed. So yeah, yeah. What else happened? Uh, yeah, I got um, damaged goods signed by Travis Oliver and Yasmin Bannerman. Uh, I offered them jelly babies. Uh, Yasmin Bannerman offered her one, and. Um, uh, she, she was happy to be to be out off the jelly baby, and then uh, and then Tra Travis Oliver sat there like, oh, you got a jelly baby, I want a jelly baby, or something like that. So I offered something, offer him a jelly baby. Um, yeah, I offered him a jelly baby uh, as I was handing him my the damage goods covers to get signed as well, and he said, no, I will have it after I've signed. I have to earn it. I was like, okay, so he signed it. I gave him a jelly baby, and there you go. Um, I think I went to another panel. I think it might, might have been the novel. I think there's an what was it? The third Doctor panel with Kate, Katie Manning field field. That was fun. Katie Manning, Katie Manning was making so many jokes about. Well, she made a few jokes, and then they, they, it's hard to explain. It was just so nice that, to see them all there. I think uh, that's someone I spoke to. I I spoke to. Yeah, and that was the uh, no. Yes. Yes, because I went to two panels in a row. Because it was the third Doctor panel, and then the novel adaptions panel. Yes. And I think at the end of, of the thing, I started talking to the two, two guys there, and they were talking about just Big Finish. It was really nice to be able to talk to people about Big Finish, because none of my friends listen to Big Finish. I don't know why. 
So yeah, uh, I think after those two panels, both of them really good, I then decided, uh, I then went to get autographs from uh, India Fisher and Lisa Greenwood. Yeah, this was like a two hour gap before the next panel. So, well, like I've got plenty of time, so um, because which was the Six Doctor panel, I didn't go to the early ones or the Tail Hawks. Yeah, so I got the condemned sign. I offered her a jersey, baby. Uh, she, she, she was really, she, both of them were really nice. Uh, she, she was quite, at least Indy Fisher was really had to be offered jelly baby. She, and she was like, oh, this being a nice sugar rush I need. Like, <laughs> it's really fun. And then um, I got the Curse of Davros signed by Lisa Greenwood. I offered her jelly baby, but she declined. Not because she didn't like them, because she'd found over lunch she'd had some sort of gigantic chocolate thing. I want, I got a cake or pie or something like that. And, um, what was it? Yeah, and then I got. Um, the world's a big finish signed by. Hang on, it's not, not the actual cover. I had to get that bit on the inside signed by. Uh, yeah, I got that signed by Nicholas Briggs. Only just because um, he was talking to. Um, how was it called? Yeah, because I, I knew he had the state and more stage panels. So I thought because only he's one of the executive producers of Big Finish. So I thought like, well, I need to get an autograph from him. But he's so busy, so I had to quickly go like, Nick, Nick, could you please just sign this for me quickly? So it's, and he did, and my mum got, my mum bought and talked to Conspiracy Brothers to get it for my, for her friend's birthday. She got like loads of people to sign it. That was good. But then we didn't really have anything else to do. I think I bought a bit more merchandise and then when, I started, when we decided there's not really much to do until five o'clock when the sixth Doctor panel was on. So I decided to go into the sort of a restaurant bar thing. So I went and sat on one of the tables in there and I saw sort of a few tables down was um TJ Productions and Purchase Smith Eleven. And I decided that this is actually I will say this is actually the highlight of the day when this happened. I decided I'm gonna go th say thank you to TJ Productions for getting me to be finished because if it wasn't for him uploading his video with Big Finish over a year ago, I think in two thousand thirteen, I wouldn't be uh, have my Big Finish collection as it is. Also, one thing I did notice is that on the Big Finish website, like, a little later on, I think it was yesterday, when Big Finish put their thank you, like Big Finish Day, thank you for everyone who came. On the pictures, they're actually on. There's a picture of those two on the Big Finish website. They are on the Big Finish website. I don't know if they've seen this. I'm assuming they have. I hope they have. If not, I'm going to mention it to them. I'll come to that later. So yeah, that was. <laughs> I was really impressed to see them on the Big Finish website. So yeah. What happened? As, and I went over, I said thank you. I was, he, he did what he did at um, Day of Doctor. He had a box full of um, Big Finish stuff that he'd bought. I saw him when he was selecting them out and paying for them. He, he was sort of counting them like that, trying to get, take them to pay for them. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah, so yeah, um, uh, yeah, I went to say thank you. We start we started talking for about a minute or so, and then I asked like, may I? They were set. Uh, may I join you in a sort of chat? And they and they sort of um, yeah. And there's a seat there. There's no one sitting here. Help you. They can go on then. So I, so, so I sat down right, and I was talking to TJ Productions and Purchase Smith Eleven for over an hour because we talked about big finish stuff. I had a look, I got to have a look at his sonic screwdrivers that he's got his two personalized sonic screwdrivers. The sort of model one and the actual light up one. They they were really good. The the, the sort of classic one, sort of hold it out like that one. It's a lot smaller than it looks, but the pointy like that one is really good. Yeah, I've got. I offered the end of Jelly Bears as well. That was early on the day though. That, it was so nice to be able to meet them. I was so happy to meet them. And th 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 they were so nice and I was talking to them. We, we started talking about non-Big Finish stuff. I was talking about like what happened when I went on holiday once. And I spent like 70 years on sweets and crisps because I had to spend it on something because otherwise I wouldn't get as much money back for it. <sighs> that was fun. So yeah, we were talking for talking about Big Finish. I was talking that they were horrified when I told them that my collection is actually organised by Doctor and not um, um, Range. They looked horrified. So uh, it was it was really great fun talking to them. And, that, and as like I think TJ went off to sort of because they they didn't stay for the last six Doctor panel because they were getting back. They had to get back for big uh, for the new episode of Doctor Who, which aired on the same day. Um, my face is like half of it sort of. Well, in half a sort of dark. I can't help that because I got uh, um, what's it called? A window. That's it. And I've got I've got two lights on to try and illuminate this side, but it's not really working, and the exposure thing hasn't really worked that well either. Anyway, where was I? Oh, yeah, he went off to make a phone call to get a lift home because they were both doing um, 
uh, Hoovian High Council about the new episode, so I had to be back in time and stuff. I didn't actually say that to me. I actually realised that they were on that later on when I got back that night. Because I, I didn't, I didn't watch it. The Magician's Apprentice when it first on. I actually had to um, uh, watch it about ten o'clock at night when we got back. So, um, oh, what else? What else? Oh, yeah, that was it. Yeah, the um, yeah. Well, I asked uh, Pokemon Eleven when the next big finish fans would be, and he said it would be this Friday. Uh, so, and they're going to be doing it on the Six Doctor Last Adventure. Hang on, get out of the way. Yeah, and then um, you know, I I, I said to, uh, I said to them like I I've, I've I said to him like um I've watched whenever I'm watching I was like I wish I could talk to you as well. And then he said you can be on it if you you can join if you want. And I, and I I obviously said I, 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 of course I would. So I am actually going to be on Big Finish fans this Friday, hopefully, talking about the. Six Doctor, The Last Adventure. Once I've listened to it, I've got to listen to that. I'm going to listen to that tomorrow and Thursday. That way it's fresh in my head as much as possible. That was... Yeah, so then... Yeah, I, he said he messes me... What day is it? It's Tuesday. So he, he said he messes me on Thursday about it. I hope he does, because if he doesn't, I'm going to be really upset, because I really want to talk to them. Because um, this, I'm going to be talking to... I'm, also, I'm going to be talking to TDA Reductions and Purchase Myth 11 again. But I'm also going to be talking to Tardis Crime 123 and Custopus the Fibster as well. Hopefully they're normally on there, so and that's going to be interesting. Well, I really want them. It sounds a bit odd, but I really want them to like me. I, I want, I want to be. I've always wanted to be a group part of one of these sort of Hoovian YouTube communities, and Big Fin Fans is one of those. And I really want to be. I, I, I don't get to talk to people about Big Finish at all. Now, sort of the first time I'd be able to talk to people about Big Finish. I've never been able to talk to people about Big Finish before, and it was so nice. And they were so nice to me. Yeah, it was so nice. Yeah, and then after that, that I uh, had to go get a mum from the car, but she'd gone back to the car while I was talking to them. And then we went to the um, uh, Sick Doctor panel, which we, and, that, and that was great. So, uh, uh, Colin Baker, India Fish, and Instagram, they were all great fun. Well, I mean, the, well the, their presenter sort of turned up late, so they were, so Colin was like, Where's the presenter? Or something like that. Is there, is there a hosting or something like that? But, um, yeah, and then once that was finished, me and mum, we went got in the car and drove home whilst listening to um Torture Conspiracy. I did whilst at the event I did want to get uh Math Fit and design uh the Eye of the Dark Eye of Darkness, I think it was, from Dark Eyes 4, and I wanted to get Beth Chalmers to sign uh the Crime of the Century, which we listened to on the way there. Oh excuse me. So um I, I was a bit uh, uh, but I, I saw Beth Chalmers but I thought like oh there's no cue for her, I'll get uh, with Indie Fish on this screen first. But then when I went back to try and get an autograph from her, she'd vanished. I couldn't find her again at during the event and I just did not find um how's she called Matt Fitton to get in the sign, so that was really annoying. It's really annoying me how half my face is sort of lights I do it. I might see if I can fix that in editing if I can. But yeah, that, that oh yeah, um well just the um uh, the complete history series. I'm gonna be putting that on hold for the time being until I've got a job now. Even though I've only done one episode of that, but mainly because I just can't afford it. It goes like ten pound each issue. That's gonna leave me like five pound a month. I need more than five pound a month. Because obviously I've got, I, I buy the comic and stuff. I need uh, these. I have to keep getting. I'm going to hopefully try and keep getting the tortured audios there ten quid each. So I'm going to put that on hold. Um, that's, I think that's the main update. Everything else is sort of same. Same the um. um not the adaption, no, not the Virgin Territory series are still going to be going the um, main uh, Mega Doctor Who review marathon. That's still going to be going ahead. I will be reviewing Mahogany Murders and ah, what's it called? The beginning. I'm going to be recording them tomorrow, both of them. I'm going to get them up at some point. I'm not going to say when because that never works. I've seen TJ Productions. <laughs> He, no, no offense to you, TJ. If you're watching this, I, I hope you are. So yeah, because because he never seems to be able to stick to his schedule that much. I hope he can because obviously he just got that. nothing against you, TJ. That's uh, you, you. You just can't do it. So yeah, I'm not going to try and stick to, to a schedule. I'm just going to do like me. I'll do that there. And I add that there. That there. So yeah, I'm might, I'm going to be listening to um, Lords of the Planet later on today. So hopefully I might I might do you on that as well if I like that. So. Uh, yeah, I'm going to be on big. So the next day, boys, see me. I'll most likely be on Big Finish fans six. I think it is. Yeah, Big Finish fans six. So that's going to be really fun. I'm really looking forward to that. But actually, normally I go down to my dad's this Friday, and then uh, I normally go down to my dad's every other weekend. And that's normally when I where, where I get money. 
I don't, that's my only source of money. So, I don't know. Hopefully, that should be sorted soon, though. So, yeah, but, but I'm not going down this weekend be, so I can do big Finnish fans. So, I'm looking, I'm looking forward to that. I really hope, I'm really looking forward to um, talking to them all about uh, the sick doctor. I think there's always like a new section as well. So I'll be talking about that. I'll probably be talking about the new countermeasures. I'm quite. In, I really want to get into countermeasures. That's because uh, I'm like Jungle Life. But countermeasures is a smaller series and less of it. And I, I like Jungle Life. Like exactly like ten series. Like that's a lot. Ten box sets to buy. Whereas countermeasures only four and one prequel. So yeah. Uh, yeah, I think that's everything. Um, I'll see you. Uh, although I, I doubt I, 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 any of the. No, no, no never mind. No, never mind, forget I just said that. Yeah, so I'll see, hopefully, hopefully some of you will come to watch the Big Finish fans on Friday. Uh, that is hosted by Poetry Miss Eleven, so go, like, go f subscribe to him. Uh, uh, go subscribe to all, all of the Big Finish fans, the TD Productions, Tarsica 123, Custodia Fibs, go subscribe to them, because uh, they're the ones who are in it with, with me, even though I'm sort, of, I'm, I'm, I'm sort of tagging along for this one. I hope that I can do more with them. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, Ghost Guard, uh, specifically Purchase Mid 11 because he's the one who's hosting it, so that'll probably come, it'll be on his channel. So, not, not on my channel or their channels, just Purchase Mid 11. So, uh, using Google Hangouts, I think it is. So, I've got, I, I'm still sort of learning how that works, so hopefully, uh, we can get that done properly and right. Well, it's, 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 but we thought they always do a great job because, like, there's a new thing, the main part, which will be the Seek to Last Adventure and. Oh, how's it called? Questions. You always take questions from the comment section, from the chat or comment section. Asking me because I'm not the one answering, asking questions. Not, I'm not, this time I'm going to be answering them. Oh, I hope so, anyway. If, if they don't message me, I'm going to be like, oh. Please. If you're watching this, please do message me. I don't want to message me before the about it. I don't want to. It's sort of, you, you. Never mind. <laughs> Just message me, please. So, yeah. Uh, I think that's everything. Train Bang 44, out.